Hi, it's Sarah here and welcome to my channel. In this video, I am going to be walking you through a Sunday in my life where I'm not feeling productive. It was a really fun weekend full of lots of things. It was Robbie's birthday weekend and so I was just feeling very tired. I just wanted to lay out in my leggings and my hoodie and do nothing, but I knew that wasn't possible because I did actually have things that I needed to get done this day. So I'm just going to show you the things that I did and how I was able to get myself to be productive. So after laying in bed for probably at least an hour, I ended up getting up, getting dressed, and I got ready for the day, did my skincare, did my hair somewhat. Um, I don't usually do makeup most days, or at least especially not days where I don't need to wear any makeup. And then I took the sheets off the bed so that I could wash them. I usually do the sheets every Sunday. Sometimes I'll do it on Monday if we have other things going on Sunday or if I just don't feel up to it yet. Um, so I did do that. I usually put the towels in the load with that as well. And then I just wanted to say that if you enjoy these types of videos like productivity, motivation, cleaning, organizing, decluttering, tidying, all that good stuff, then I hope you will subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. And also if you enjoyed this video, I hope that you will hit the thumbs up button down below as well. It helps me out so much more than you would know. It tells YouTube that people are enjoying my video and they will send it out and share it with other people who may be interested in these types of videos as well so that we can continue to grow here on YouTube together. So after I I finished tidying up the apartment. Robbie and I decided to go and get brunch. It was for his birthday brunch. We went to Bacon Social House in Littleton. It was so good and it was a really pretty day. I had to show the fall trees and just the pretty mountains, the sun popping out. It was just wonderful. And then after this, we got home. I cozied up on the couch and I did my planning for the week. And then I also did my grocery planning. I took a little like cat nap here while I was just laying here. I pretty much just rest my eyes. I don't usually actually take a nap ever, um, but that was pretty nice. And then after this, I went to grocery shopping. I went to Trader Joe's and then I went to Target because I had a bunch of different things to get and I like the produce better from Trader Joe's than Target. Then it was just time to put everything away and I was starting to feel much more motivated at this point. After going to lunch for some reason I just started to feel motivated. I'm not really sure why or like what caused that um, but I was glad for that because I did have things I needed to get done so it's easier to get done when you're actually feeling like you can do it. Um, so yeah after that I just cleaned up the fruit and I put it in the fruit bowl here and then I started to get ready to meal prep. So this week I meal prep a beef stew and it actually sat for a long time after I got it cooking on the stove. And as you can tell, I changed my entire outfit. I was starting to get really hot at this point. It was warming up as the day went on. I was really hoping that it was gonna be a cooler day because I wanted to just be cozy in my cozy clothes, but this clothes is still cozy as well. And so yeah, that's why I had to change. Um, this meal was really good. I will link the recipe. I actually showed this recipe in a different video as well. It was my eating fall things video. So if you want to check out some different fall recipes that I made, then you should definitely check out that video as well. Um, but yeah, I really liked this beef stew. It just wasn't super filling. I ended up needing like a grilled cheese or peanut butter sandwich or something with it. So if you make it, either just have more in your one serving or just make something else with it, I guess. Um, and then after this, I cleaned up the dishes and the stuff for the recycling. And um, after that, I had a little snack. It was just some leftover from lunch that we had. And then I just had some edamame as well because I like edamame and I had it in the fridge, so why not? And then it was time to start cleaning up. And again, the beef stew was still cooking, but I at least did the floors and I started to move into the bathroom after that. I cleaned the entire bathroom Bathroom, which I've been trying to do once a week as well. Hey, I'm looking for a couch to crash on. I'm still night, shouldn't be the night I go home with anyone. I've been out walking on the rough for patch now. But I must say, living on the edge of things has been kind of fun. Look, there's a bruise right here. Short foot on the show. I'm dancing on the tables, and I must say, I got a taste for a flip and I'm glancing at the haters, and I know they wish they did the shit I did tonight. She wanna break some things, alright. All of the cups are out of sight. She wanna drink, cause I can buy. You're dancing on the table, so am I. I'm not 
Officially the one who acts out All those crazy little things we all kind of dream about A good thing we are running out of sunlight It's not necessary for these guys to know all about Look, there's a bruise right here One or a few on there Short foot on the show I'm dancing on the tables And I must say I got a taste for a flip and out I'm glancing at the haters And I know they wish they did the shit I did tonight You wanna break some things, alright All of the cups are out of sight You wanna drink, cause I can buy You're dancing on the table, so am I Did you see? Short foot on a show And then after the cleaning was done, I took a shower, did my skincare, got in my PJs, and the soup was done, so it was time to just put the soup in containers. And then I just ate dinner, we watched a movie, we just hung out and relaxed, and it was a great day all in all. So I hope that you enjoyed this video, that you got some motivation to do something today if you're not feeling productive, and that you are doing well. Thank you so much for watching. Take care. Bye.